It's surgery day! I'm so nervous. Like, they're literally gonna cut my face open. Like, I've seen what a rhinoplasty looks like. Oh, this is crazy. Like, last look. Katie's in surgery right now, guys. I'm scared. Are you nervous for her nose? Yeah, a little bit. I don't know what I'm looking at. There she is. How you feeling? I do not feel good. Update, just threw up a ton of blood. Projectile vomited. Babe, wake up. It's surgery day. It's surgery day! Let's go. Wow, I can't believe this day is finally freaking here. I'm low-key like freaking out. Guys, I look so bad because my skin literally just like broke out out of nowhere last night. So ignore that. I'm really annoyed that that happened. But anyway, guys, last night I pretty much just had to take a shower with a certain type of soap to prepare. I had to stop eating all water and food at 12 o'clock. It is like 5.20 right now. So that's maybe when my voice sounds really weird. We're about to go to the surgery center really quick. I'm gonna show you guys my surgery outfit because you have to wear like certain things for it so you have to wear a zip up hoodie because that way like you don't want to pull anything over your face so I got this cute zip up hoodie from Abercrombie and Fitch and then I also got these really cute um, joggers from Abercrombie and Fitch too they're just like these nude ones and then you also have to buy compression socks like really ugly like medical socks that like kind of come up to here and I don't know why I think it's like for blood clots and stuff I don't even know how to explain how I'm feeling right now I'm so excited I'm so nervous guys I've literally wanted this done probably since I was nine years Years old and if you guys are new to this channel if you're just watching because like you want to get a nose job that's literally what I did I'd watch like a million YouTube videos to like figure out like what the process was like I'm gonna try and keep this like as real as possible show you guys everything tell you guys everything and hopefully it's helpful for you guys if you guys are just a JD fam supporting and then you guys will get so much information and I'm so excited for it I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. Like, they're literally gonna cut my face open. Like, I've seen what a rhinoplasty looks like. My first mistake. But, um, I've heard it really wasn't too painful. So, we're gonna see. And I will see you guys at the surgery center. Alright, guys. My mom's here all the way from Florida to come nurse us. Florida. Because... Wait, why did I say Florida? <laughs> it's so early and I am so Not tired. Really she, came, she came from Michigan. I don't even know why I said Florida. Yes. But she's here. She's going to come help us because obviously Josh was supposed to help me, but that's not going to work out. I'm going to help Josh. Dang, it's about time. I got to say Josh goodbye to go the old nose. Bye to the old nose. Mom, I'm say gonna goodbye. I'm going to miss it. Uh, I but Fine. You gave birth to it. I oh my god. It. Guys, I'm sad. You Josh gave birth to it. Josh will be able to come it. in. I'm gonna um I'm gonna try and get one of the nurses too. Yeah, I'm not allowed to come in. Hopefully it's stupid COVID, man. I really hope stupid they can, COVID. but I'm gonna be all out of it, so I'm not gonna be like, yo, go grab a camera unless I do say that when I'm like all out of it. She might YouTubers say YouTubers out here. They yeah. really might. But I'm nervous! I'm nervous. So excited. I'm not even getting surgery. Wait, I'm to, like, nervous. I have to take in breathing. Like, okay, it's maybe it won't be it's so smelling. bad. Oh, shut <laughs> yeah, up. Smelling. Please. Please. <sighs> I'm nervous. Any last words? Let's get let's get a last preview of the old nose. Where's she gone? <laughs> okay guys, it is time to get changed. I'm gonna show you what I'm wearing versus what I'm going to be wearing. So I'm wearing this and then I need to put all this stuff on. I'm gonna look really funny. But guys, I just had to take a pregnancy test live. So we'll see what happens here. Let's hope not. <laughs> guys, look how funny it looks. Look at this. Obviously I had to put all my hair in it, but this is the dress. Ooh, she's cute. But um, these are the booties. And guys, the surgeon that I went to is Dr. Shapiro because like I did so much research online and he was like the best. So that is why I'm here. Um, I'm doing a rhinoplasty. Literally just gonna take out the bump. If you guys haven't seen my other videos, go watch those first and then watch this so you guys can watch the whole journey. But I really always hated how there was a bump here. Super insecure about it. Super excited to get rid of it and just like feel 100% confident. I'm excited for it. Why do I look like a jellyfish? <laughs> I have to put my hair all up in this net, but I've just been filling out paperwork and stuff and oh, this is crazy. Like. Last look. My nose isn't terrible. It's just like from the side, like certain angles, it looks so bad. But you know what? If you have a nose like me, I don't even want to encourage plastic surgery. It's just something that's like, it's always bothered me. And like, there's other things that like I could change about myself, but they don't bother me. Like I have small boobs, but I don't want a boob job. Like things like that, you know, it's not about just like changing yourself. It's about like fixing an insecurity for me so I can be like my full confident self and not let that get in the way of anything in my life, so. Don't want to encourage it, but just want to say why I did it. All right, guys, I'm with Dr. Shapiro, and he is going to mark up my nose. I mean, right, you do yeah, this all yeah. the time. So. I do it all the time. So we're going to mark up your profile here, mm -hmm. and then we're going to go in the operating room, and then boom, it'll be done. And then boom, new nose. <laughs> okay. Perfect. Good. All right.
There we go. Yeah, another way for now. Soft and beautiful. Oh, and wow. See, see how the tip's gonna come up and we're gonna take down the dorsum here. Yeah. Okay, and then let me just show you the other side. Here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, is that cool? So you can just kind of see this is where the, the new profile is. Oh. That's it. Wow. Right on. That's crazy. Yeah. All right, guys, Katie's getting her nose job, which means I gotta distract her mom for four hours. Yeah. I gotta take care of this one. Oh, really? I have to take care of you. I'm the guy in the wheelchair, and I gotta take care <laughs> of her. I gotta show her around Arizona. Oh so, my God. you know, Joshy B, the tour guide, we took her to our wedding venue. So here we are. And Josh took the view of the palm trees and gave me the view of the kitchen. Thanks. You know, <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I kind of did, you actually. Did. But, you uh, didn't think about your future mother. We're gonna show her around the, after we get some breakfast. Um, some brekkie here. Your boy got, what is this? I don't even know. I don't drink coffee. Americano. That's a, a latte. Oh, a latte. and then you, Katie has FOMO. She's jealous that we're hanging out and she's missing out. Yeah, sorry Catherine. You can watch it all on the vlog. She's going under anesthesia soon, so let's get it. Ooh, we eating good. We're splitting a meal. Is that weird? We're bonding. <laughs> is that weird? <laughs> we at the wedding venue, guys. Looking sick, you know, same as always. What are your thoughts, Karen? I approve. You approve? I'll push you down the aisle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hopefully in a couple weeks here, I'll be walking down that way. Not wheelchairing, but we will see. It's but, called yeah. a vision board. <laughs> a vision board. <laughs> yeah. Katie's in surgery right now, guys. Uh, sh she even texted me I love you before. Kind of rude, but uh, yeah, I think she is at least because she hasn't texted me back, but uh, I'm scared. Are you nervous for her nose? Yeah, a little bit. She's gonna look great though. <sighs> we'll see. Yo, good news, JD fam. Finally, it's been three hours. I was getting a little nervous. As soon as I started calling the doctor office, like to check up on her and make sure everything's good, they were actually calling me. So I answered and it was the doctor and he said the surgery went good. She's gonna love it. Nose looks perfect, yada, yada, yada. He's sending me some pictures, so I'm actually super very curious to see these and now we got to wait another hour for her to come out of the anesthesia and then we'll pick her up see what's good she's got a vlog camera on her hopefully she's not like on anesthesia vlogging or so bro i wasn't playing send help <laughs> she literally just put the car she turned my car off to go into pee doesn't put the car in park takes her foot off the brake we start rolling back i'm like bro stop the car stop the car she, we're just rolling back into the oncoming traffic guys no, i'm not gonna make it out of <laughs> okay, well besides almost rolling into oncoming traffic, I'm good. I had the pics from the doctor and they're honestly, they're kind of scary because Katie's like lying on the table and she like looks dead. Like she's like under anesthesia, like passed out. It's kind of scary to see. And like her face is like a little bruised up already. It looked painful, I'm not gonna lie. Like all her nose right here was all bruised and like purple and black. But hopefully her eyes don't bruise too bad because I was thinking, I was telling her the other day, I was like, it's gonna look like we got in a fight if we go out in public. Like, here, she's gonna have a big cast on her nose, two black eyes. I'm gonna have broken ankles in a wheelchair. Like, it's not gonna be a good look. But I had the pictures. It looks dope. It looks good. And I feel like you gotta see it in person. Like, it's hard to tell, like, she's laying down, like, just post surgery. But I don't know if I can show you guys. I feel like this is Katie's thing, you know, like, so she's gotta show you. So I'm gonna keep the picture on my phone and uh, we'll see maybe she'll be cool showing you guys in this video or maybe she wants you to wait see the big reveal till like the cast comes off and everything we'll see she's gonna be we're gonna pick her up soon so I'll ask her and let you guys know but crazy man her old oh man her old nose it like I don't know I'm kind of like back and forth on it like I'm part part of me sad like I'm gonna miss like the old nose but like you know as long as Katie's happy I'm gonna be happy that's all I care about so I'm sure she'll be happy she's been wanting to do this since she was nine years old but I'm happy Hopefully we make it to her because Karen's driving is honestly scaring me. So wish me luck, guys. Uh, all right, guys. I don't know what I'm looking at, but I'm very on pay beds. No nose to this, <laughs> but yeah, I'll update you guys a little bit. But I can't really talk right now. I can't even see. <laughs> oh my god, bro, she looks so funny with this cast. There she is. How you feeling? Oh, I guess I gotta get out. Good. Yeah. Yeah, what the heck? Yeah. I, I got broken ankles, babe. Did you forget? Yeah, you get it back. <laughs> this is payback. Nah, that girl looks snatched, though. <laughs> You're gonna marry that. <laughs> I don't even know what I look like. I, you, you look don't. like a hot mess. You look like I'm gonna be honest you. You were in an MMA fight. You look like... I'm on so many drugs right now. 
<laughs> Honey, do you need more? Do you need more? There's a cold air. Box. Cheers the camera, babe. I have a box. <laughs> What's hot. Like, Bahama bucks. Like, oh, what kind of AC on? <laughs> Bro. You know, this is probably a bad time to ask, but who is my boyfriend, Felipe? Your what? What? What'd you say? My boyfriend's Felipe. Your boyfriend's what? Felipe. Felipe? You find out about him. Yeah, I was just gonna say, who's Felipe? I don't know. He's cute. Is he cute? Is he just like a, is he just a boyfriend or are you gonna marry him? I feel like a lot. Huh? I'm a dead mom lab. Is that anything? I feel like a blob. Blob lab. Um, big wedding coming up. Tell us how you feel about it. Do I look good? I think I just do my makeup for it. Are you modeling for your wedding? <laughs> how do you feel about that uh, fiance you're gonna marry? He's hot. He's really cute. He's I. He's an idiot, but he's cute. Why is he an idiot? Broke both of his legs, but he's cute. <laughs> Look at you, broken nose. Where, chill out, you look like you just got kicked in the head. I was beat up, it was my fault. Yeah, Juan tells the story, what happened? Did you get jumped? Yeah. yeah. They're like, your nose isn't good enough, so we're gonna beat you up and change it. I was no. like, no. Were you at Starbucks? Did you cut in line at Starbucks or something? Yeah, this dude was so bad at me. Wow. I'm sorry, dude. I just wanted my Starbucks. <laughs> Alright, go to sleep. Which pants is that? What's up guys? I do not feel good. Tried to eat mashed potatoes so I could take all my pay beds, but I'm so full for some reason. And I just can't eat. I just want my pay beds. No. Guys, I don't like seeing Katie be like that. She looks she looks like she got beat up. I don't like seeing it. She looks so sad. <laughs> you gotta eat your food. You want me to feed you? Update, just threw up a ton of blood. Projectile vomited. How was that? Uh, very disgusting. I wish we vlogged it, but uh, she literally, I don't even know how to explain it. It looked like a flamethrower. Like, it wasn't like, it was like. I'm bad, because it took me so long to try to eat food. They say mothering never ends, and I get it. Sure, shout out Karen, because. Still cleaning up throw up. I'm crippled. Yeah. Hey, can't do nothing about it, sorry. <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right, guys, Bella came to come check up, Bobby. Hi, guys. Just had to check on Katie. I've been like so worried about you. I know. All day. Karen, how are you feeling? Good. Look, Hi. my eyes are pretty, pretty bruised. Good. You did look good. Much better Honestly, than like, earlier. I was expecting way worse, and I was expecting you to be like in bed, like not moving, but here she is. I feel, I literally, I don't know what happened. I got back and I had to eat, and I was eating for to um, take my medicine, and I was not hungry at all. So I had a little bit of mashed potatoes, and I was just eating them, and I was like, all of a sudden, I was like, I took the nausea pill, it was, but it didn't like get my system. And like within like five minutes, I was like, oh my God, I'm gonna throw up. And I threw up straight blood because yeah, all the blood like just drips back. So, so it was glad really I gross. <laughs> yeah, Bella, Bella would probably would have passed out. It was yeah. really gross, Bella. Josh texted me, he's like, actually, I'm so glad you're not here right now because I probably would have thrown up too and then yeah. it would have just been a disaster. And that was actually like, I wish Bella was here. No. <laughs> but I'm super excited because it looks like my nose looks really good so far. It's so good. And um, the doctor shows a picture. I'm not gonna show you guys yet. I'll show you guys. <laughs> But um, no, I, my doctor was really good. And I'm really happy about it. Like he made me feel really good the whole time. If you guys want to check him out, his name is Dr. Shapiro. I'll leave him link down below. And like literally Shapiro. the no, the whole time he was like, he literally was like, oh, how are you doing? Like it's okay. he always like had oh, his hand. He's like, it's okay, it's okay. I was like, okay. Yeah, he called and talked to Josh for a long time on the phone. Uh, did he? Yeah. Josh. So you're the worst patient he ever had. Excuse oh, wow. me, did he say he saw me naked? Cause I almost got naked. <laughs> I literally. Said, we don't like, know why she was naked. We just told her to put this gown on and she got undressed. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> they literally like, the gown was on and then they're like, okay, we're just gonna pull it on the back. So they started like, taking it off. So I was like, okay, I guess I gotta get naked. <laughs> and then they're like, no, no. And then you like put it down? No, I like started to and then the nurse was like, no, you're good. But wow. yeah. A little update, I am eating um, really tidy pie apple squares because it is so hard to eat anything right now. I can already tell my nose is gonna be so cute. What's up you guys? I have a hiccup right now so that's kind of annoying. <gasps> Oh, that hurt my nose. Um, I think upside down. But anyway, I am actually eating some mac and cheese. Well, I haven't ate it yet. I'm gonna be honest, the hardest thing for me is like eating when I'm not hungry. Like the pain meds make you so not hungry, but you have to eat. So you can take your pain meds and your medication and you have to take your medication that way. Like your swelling doesn't get bad. You don't get an infection, all this stuff. So like, I'm trying to be very, very good about taking every 
everything. Other than once I stop feeling pain, I'm gonna chill on the pain meds for a little bit just because I know pain meds are like not good for you. So this is what I got. Got a little mac and cheese and here we go. Ah. Wow, that's weird. It literally has like no flavor because like you can't smell. But it's not gross. It's just like it doesn't really have flavor. You know, actually, I still could taste the flavor up even though I couldn't smell was the pineapple. I really think once I get the splits out, so right now there's these two splits that are like are packing that are up in my nose. I'm gonna get those out like two, three days. Once I get those removed, I'm gonna be able to breathe. I'm gonna feel a million times better and it's just gonna be nice. I just wanna come out here and say thank you guys so much for all your love and support. It has meant so much. You guys are even sending like love to my surgeon, which is really cool because like he's done an amazing job and he like took care of me. So like the fact that you guys care so much about me that you're reaching out to him to thank him was super sweet. But yeah, I literally am so, so happy. I thought I was gonna be very nervous about getting my cast off and stuff, but I've seen a picture of the operating room like before and after after what it looks like and it looks so cute and obviously you can't tell 100% because you can't see your face in the picture you can just see like a close-up of the nose but when I take off like this stuff and I look at my nose I'm like it looks so cute so I am very very excited about that um it's gonna be so nice to finally just like be able to turn my face and like not feel insecure about it but as far as pain goes it's just like uncomfortable it's a little painful it's not terrible like I'm not sitting there with my face throbbing it's just like when you talk it hurts a little more when you drink water it hurts a little more which I like I need to drink water because like so that's okay this is the like downside of it if you get grossed out by blood maybe click off but your blood drips all the way down your throat from your nose so you're, if you cough you're literally just coughing up blood like a ton of blood and I threw up blood earlier so it's like a lot of blood in your system but I think that's just like day one when it's like obviously initial and then it'll get better. I really feel like I'll be like a lot better tomorrow. And as far as bruising going, like I definitely have bruising, but I've seen it way worse. Like that's not that bad. It's really not that bad. My surgeon also had us take stuff like ahead of time, like um, all these like medications to make sure I don't bruise before. So I was like really prepared for this, but I am going to go eat my mac and cheese and then I'm gonna take my pay beds and then I'm gonna go back to bed. So that's my little update. And I just wanna say I love you guys and I really appreciate all the support. Like I know when I get my cast off, I'm probably gonna like cry. It's gonna be very like, I'm just gonna be so happy. And I just wanna thank you guys so much. All right guys, um, I just put my hair up in a bun and I cleaned out this part it's still really gross and bloody I can tell that like my face is swollen like my cheek stuff so now I really gotta like make sure I just keep icing and stuff but super excited I think it's gonna look really cute mother what do you think do you think it looks cute it looks adorable I actually really really like it and it's it not even off yet it's just different it's cool like swollen, so. yeah I and I know, I gotta put some like cream on it. So. All right guys, I feel like the coloring went down a tiny bit, but I'm more puffy and swollen. I've been trying to um, ice my face. And also, I don't know if I talked about this, I freaking broke out so bad right before surgery. And like leading up to surgery, I was like, oh, I really hope my skin's clear because I'm not gonna be wearing makeup for like these vlogs. And I'm so bad about it, that's so bad. So ignore that, but I think I was just like really stressed about surgery, but I'm really happy with it. And my good friend, my good friend Bella is here. You mean Topper? Or she you right, the cute thing in the world. It's Topper. me. It's me. Bella. Bella came over to come hang out. Josh is just, you know, doing what he does. I'm playing right. video we games. We some pineapple drinks. There oh yeah. Are. Bella maybe a uh, fire pineapple drink. And the reason is because pineapple helps you like um, swelling go down. And then guys, I want to see my, my five star dinner since like I'm not hungry at all. The pineapple juice was really good because it, it was like juice and it, like I'm super dehydrated feels like. This is my dinner. I'm like not hungry at all for the medicine, which probably going to lose a little bit of weight. We'll see. I'll up do you guys have that? It hurts so bad to swallow because I feel like when you swallow, your nose moves a little bit. But I've been putting peas up my head a lot. This is what I look like. My new nose looks so cute though. All right, guys, I am getting ready to go to bed. It is, I think it's like 11.30 and this is what my eyes look like. I'm really scared that tomorrow morning they're gonna look really bad because I know I've watched a lot of people's like YouTube videos and they go to bed and they look like way worse. So I really hope that's not me. I'm like still dripping like a ton of blood. But this is, I wanna show you guys something I ordered. So if anyone, I know a lot of people will be watching this video who who want to get a nose job or are interested in it or like are about to because that's what I did. I watched like a million nose job videos. If you are, this product they ordered on Amazon, it's like a pillow wedge. It's so you can sleep on an angle because you're supposed to sleep with your head elevated and it's just like a lot comfier. So I have that for tonight. 
And then I'm just gonna put my pillow on top of it. And then um, I was using it earlier and it really just helped me stay like propped up and stuff. But as far as pain goes, I'm doing pretty good. I've only taken one pain killer when I got back from the surgery. And then after that, I took a half of one like a couple hours ago, just because I was like, I don't wanna take one. Like I was like, I kind of feel like, like Bella was gonna come over, we're gonna watch The Bachelor. And um, I was just kind of like, it doesn't hurt that bad. So I don't really wanna take pain meds because they're not good for you. But now it's not hurting, it just feels a little more uncomfortable and I wanted to save uh, taking it for when I go to bed that way I could sleep good so I take one of those when I go to bed and then I'll update you guys in tomorrow's vlog but I am gonna go to bed thank you guys so much for all the support you guys have been so sweet all your messages are literally gonna make me cry I'm so excited to see my nose it looks so cute like already ignore my acne I'm literally so sad about it like I never have this bad of acne and of course the videos where I'm like wearing no makeup it freaks out but whatever who cares we all have it it's a part of life like whatever but anyway I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys the next one. Josh is gonna say goodbye though. Josh, say goodbye. Say goodbye to the JD fan. See you, JD fan. Bella. <laughs> pew, pew, pew. Holding my breath and I'm ready to go. I found what I want and I know that we're on top. So I'll dive in and I'm ready to whoa. Holding my breath and I'm ready to go. I catch you laughing.